In this video, I'm going to show you how you can have forms or applications on your Discord server. Say in the case you want to have a moderator, you want to run applications, like you want to know more about them, ask them a few questions, you want to make a form. Instead of doing like a standard Google form, we can do one directly here on Discord and I'm going to show you how. So for this, we're going to be using this bot called Application Bot. I'm going to leave the link in the description because they don't have like a specific website. So once you're here on top.gg, you can just invite the bot, click here, invite. Then we're gonna select our server, continue. There we go. So now that we have the button on our server here, the place where you set up the questions is in the dashboard. So we're gonna type in the command to get the link to get the dashboard. So percentage help, and we're gonna have this dashboard right here, dashboard application .bot. Once we're here on this dashboard, we're gonna click on our server right here. This might change because the developers of these bots, they continue updating their stuff. So if you're watching this video and it's been like a while since it was uploaded, please don't blame me if they change it. It's not my fault, okay? So once you click on your server on the left, you're gonna have a few icons. For you to set up the questions, you're gonna click on the pencil. And for you to see the responses, you're gonna click on this clipboard. But let's set up a few questions first. Let's go and click create new. We're gonna create a new form. And then we're gonna have it down here, new application. We're gonna name it, um, let's say, we're going to click on save and now we have the name of the form. So now we're going to add the questions that we want to have in our form. So basically just type in the questions that you want people to answer. I'm just going to put in a few ones. Just go on type in the questions that you want to add. This is completely up to you. And once you do, make sure that you hit save so that all the questions are saved. And that's pretty much all you have to do on the form side. If you go back to the Discord server, I'm going to delete this thing right here so that it doesn't confuse us. If I type the percentage and then apply, we're going to get a DM by the bot, which is going to include all the questions that we typed in. So let's click on the DM. We have the application started and then we type in our answers. What's your favorite Pokemon? Squirtle. Well, I mean, so, uh, yes. Um, Patricia. There you go. And I'm sure, yes, I want to apply. And that's basically it. Application has been submitted. If we go back to the um, dashboard thing and we go to the clipboard to see the answers, I'm going to refresh, click on the damn server again. Um, here we go. So now when we click on the clipboard, we have this application by this person. These are all the answers to the questions that you asked them and you can just review it. If you click accept, if you don't change anything, they're going to receive this message. Congratulations, your application has been accepted. And um, I think you can apply a role. I tried doing this and I don't think it worked, but I'm going to give it another try now. I'm just going to leave it blank so that it sends that message. I'm going to click accept application with a message above and boom. If I go back to Discord, we will see, congratulations, your application has been accepted. So basically you can directly let the person know whether they were approved or they were denied right from the actual bot. So that saves us a lot of time. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Have a wonderful rest of the day, my friends, and stay safe out there.